what's the point of waking up if you're just going to stay in bed? I'm really struggling with uh, how to understand the world, society, humans, humanity, whatever you want to call it. And I see how people get hung up on what to call it. And the debate becomes how you spell it. How is it pronounced? Not what is it? What does it do? What does it mean? I see this whole fucking info war as another layer of the deception. The deception of feeling informed, of feeling connected. Social media is designed to make us feel connected. And yet how connected are we once the plug on the internet is pulled? Yeah, I'm still smoking. The thing you might not understand about me is that I gave up hope 17 years ago. I gave up hope as a 17 year old man who was diagnosed with cancer. At that time in my life, I was very appreciative of su such a diagnosis because it made me feel like I had a place to put the depression that had already existed in me for about five years. I chose radiation as a treatment. I received a dose that at the time was expressed to me as half to three quarters of the amount that I could tolerate in a lifetime. They told me this sort of to inform me that should the need arise, that treatment option would not be an option again, a second round, because it would put the radiation exposure too high. At that time, I wanted the big dramatic death by cancer. I can't deny it. I might not have expressed it then, but I certainly felt it, that I I was ready to die. I jumped from, you know, I jumped through all those, those stages of grief, right to acceptance and right to ownership. And maybe the, you know, that treatment, that exposure is why I'm a little hypersensitive to nuclear issues, radiation, leakages, um, because it's about your lifetime exposure, you know? It's not like walking through a puddle of sludge, getting sick for a couple weeks, you know, after having washed it off. I don't understand what we're doing. I'd like to hear people talk about their values, their goals, their reasons for wanting to end this sort of behavior. As far as energy production, as far as as media and, and corporate transparency, um, it's so easy to get hung up in the negative. Uh, we need to start sharing what is positive, what still remains, what is good in your life, what's happening now that makes you want to continue living. Let's share that. Let's share our vision for the future. Thanks for your time.